Welcome ladies and gentlemen, I, uh, I want to say welcome to the 8 or 888 Alliance Gate that is about to open on August 8, um, 8 of August 2020. So on the 8 of August 2020 there is going to be a Lion Gate. What is this all about? The Lion Gate is going to be helping like Spanish people. Um, so each and every one of us, that is like the Lyra gate that is going to be opening. And the Lyra has to do with the lioness. These are people who are from the Lyra star system. So as um, we are going through this process and we are understanding what is happening and what is transpiring, um, there is a whole lot of uh, um, uh, information. People are, are really, really... Um, looking for information, looking to find out what is really happening, what is really transpiring, um, you know, how life is really changing for a lot of us on this planet. And, um, you know, it is, uh, is um, you know, this year is going to be one of this year that is creating stress. And a whole lot of people have been working in order um, to help humanity at this time. A lot of you have certain um look at um um donald trump in certain different eyes but um i want you people to um understand that nothing happens for nothing okay and i think that people need to educate themselves especially in this time and question why are humanity being placed on their um um you know these changes that is happening and uh, um you know, start questioning yourself, ladies and gentlemen. It is a time to start questioning yourself. Um, I don't connect with politics. I have nothing to do with politics. I'm here to bring love and light on this heart. This is what I'm doing. Um, if you notice um, that I haven't been online, I um, it's uh, because of some medical um, situation that I'm dealing with. Um, and... Um, uh, the problem is that um, as a spiritual person and if you're doing good and if people realize that uh, um, you are really giving them information that is helping them and helping to open up their awareness, uh, um, people start to throw um, like negative shows uh, at us. So um, being a psychic and working um, in the spirit world is not one of the easiest because with everything in light and darkness, uh, just like each and every one of us have good um, side and we have the bad side, we have the ego and we have the I am present. Just is that appearing in everything in humanity. I have always advised you people and alert you people that you're not the only species on this planet. There is a lot of different species and just like as you watch the animal killing them, we have the energy um, of the lion and you can see the energy of the lion sometimes I think I have a little Lyra in in me and lion people and uh, especially um, Spanish people are really um, the um, people that is from Lyra they like um, a lot of place a lot of meat um, they like happiness and joy they like to dance salsa um, once you have Spanish descent heritage in you um, this is going to be opening. It's as if uh, each and every um, double A, double months, uh, there is a gateway that is opening. And this Lyra gateway is going to be helping humanity in a very powerful way um, that is going to be coming up. And this is why I'm doing this video because sometimes I will do other videos. Um, but this Lyra gateway on 888 is going to bring down and change and bring in significant changes. So, um, the planet is now in a, a void, okay, and there is a lot of information about the planet, and the planet is flat, and we're in spaceships. There's there's a lot of information. It is up to you to ask your higher self, is this true? Okay, so a lot of people are looking for truths, and in order to find out if something is true, ask your higher self, okay? And don't expect that it's going to come directly. Sometimes, like with myself, it will come directly because I'm a spiritual person. I will 
work with the spiritual world but also the mundane world um, a lot of spiritual people have been having um, some form of health issues um, one it can be spiritual one it can be from the negative forces that is trying to block uh, um, a hus that is doing um, good for humanity so be aware of this um, there is some um, I'm gonna leave you a lot of lists like people um, who is good to listen to things that is coming out things that you need to educate yourself over my heart breaks um, for humanity um, because humanity have been so um, on the control and I see there are the white brotherhoods and the white ads that is helping humanity in order to recreate um, the heaven on her that it should have been um, um, happening there are different species on this um, um, on this planet that have been um, you know guiding and uh, and, and um, using humanity as either uh, energy food or um, just manipulating and keeping um, humanity in slavery and now is the time that the white ads and uh, um, the higher beams uh, is coming in in order um, to release humanity um, from a destructiveness that has been going on for many years I want a lot of people to start and uh, be awakened and 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 self educate yourself where go because there's a lot of masters on this planet um, there is um, a hundred and forty four um, of us as light workers on this planet and if you want to know if a person is a true light worker um, you will know because there have been some form of health issues one of my most favorite persons and I don't know if you guys listen to dr. Sam Marie that is dr. dr. Pant Sam s a m uh, Muggsy sorry dr. Sam Muggsy um, they are on um, the 5d shift um, shifting in the 5d shift it is um, you can find it on YouTube I'm going to be leaving the link below um, she's just one of my um, favorite persons and she's also going through um, some uh, sort of uh, shift that is she's going through just as myself um, the point and the problem is that ladies and gentlemen um, you got to wake up because a lot of people do not want to know that there is the light and darkness some people just don't want to face the darkness okay some light workers some of us who is very very sensitive we can't look at uh, sadness and especially what is going on with kids and how humanity is uh, um, has been um, keep in bondage for such a long time so what we do is to pro, um, process and to help you to create a more positive uh, outlook on humanity okay so um you know for a whole lot of light workers and you will know if you're a true light worker or you're just um helpers or that sort of a thing a true light worker or having horrible situation with your kids with your family um and uh, um they're targeting light workers kids and family members so you have to be aware of this so if you are having like dramatic problems especially if you're a reader or you're a coach or you work with alternative uh, the on alternative um, you know work um, where it has to do with spiritually body mind and soul and you're realizing that you're getting a fight so you will realize that PayPal um, your payment is not coming through um, the link is not there that sort of a thing that is how um, light workers is like being attacked at this moment so be aware of it so I will give you like a little download of what is happening to me at this moment so um, um, people can understand and be aware of this now my myself and my son has been targeted and somehow um, uh, um, the um, we call them um, the dark ones okay the lower energy the negative ones 
so they have target um, my son and um, our family has not had contact and it's like a year since I'm back in Holland um, they have not have any contact with my son and whoever these people are basically blocking us from our son um, um, then on July 3rd I was going to the supermarket to get some um, stuff for um, July 4th um, barbecue I always do that because you as you guys know um, that I've returned back to Europe since August last year and I've told you what had transpired at the airport um, when I was returning so um, what is on what, what is happening is that as a light worker we are being attacked our family and friends and people um, um, people who are doing positive work in order to help humanity is being really a talk um, and uh, um, you got to be aware of this so um, thanks to all the people who had reached out to find out what was happening to me so all of a sudden I just went blind in one eye um, and um, yeah it was um, questionable how this could have happened okay so at the moment um, um, my sight has been ill so I can't be on camera because of um, uh, um, I still have a patch over my eyes so um, ladies and gentlemen um, there has been a lot because I found out about a massive uh, um, people are smuggling um, that people name and information has been changed and it's been sold in order to get people in different countries some illegal um, human smuggling that has been transpired and that is the reason why um, myself is on the attack so I really don't care because I think that uh, as I have said if I can save 10,000 people life in order to protect them from this destructiveness of other people entering countries and using people identity um, I you know uh, you know life is all about protecting each and every one of us and I am trying to protect all the people and let people be aware of uh, how your identity has been stolen because we're coming up uh, we are in the dark times ladies and gentlemen and if you gotta go back and listen to elf 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 we are in dark times ladies and gentlemen you need to wake up and learn to protect yourself more more. you need to start questioning things around you and understand who you are and what is transpired and you need to start asking questions humanity is on the brink of extinction again humanity is on the brink of extinction and if you as a human do not stand up and take your life back and take your um, values back and take Nasera and uh, I'm going to explain what that is then you are at a time where you're going to become enslaved by other beams and um, energies of other universe that is um, I have been having humanity in slavery um, all this time if you listen to me I always said I'm not from this planet because I am not from this planet and what a lot of people do not know and the dark ones do not know that is not everyone you can use negative forces to and some of us especially where I am from we are just from love and light I'm not here to have any quarrels any fight I'm teaching people to be awakened and realize who you are as an essential beam so whoever out there that is trying to create this war and this fight you can put it down because I'm love and peace so let's get that going ladies and gentlemen keep love and peace and um, ask um, AI which I'm going to explain to you guys what is AI I've given you guys a lot of links to look at and I want you guys um, 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 to look at uh, um, people who um, are having information positive information that can help you now um, 
uh, someone sent me and I, I um, a link and I decided to share it with everyone and the link is from the president of uh, Ghana um, ladies and gentlemen please the link is going to be in the description of this video go check out the video okay um, then there um, or message from him then we're looking at dr. Sam McGee she has a radio program and um, a Muggsy sorry dr. Sam Muggsy um, she has a radio program on the fifth the the five dimension shift it's a radio program you can pick it up on YouTube um, the other person I want you guys to take a look at is uh, Tales from the Ship with Kent Dan and uh, Andy. Um, and Andy, I think it is uh, Andre um, Morn Morn Morno is Spanish. Andre Morno, I think, is Mexican. So take a look at these people. There are other people. Um, there is some. Um, other people that I'm going to be looking up and um, um, putting on the list and the links below um, in order um, for you guys to start questioning things and listen not everyone will be um, connected to you so I can advise you guys of this not everyone will be connected to you um, but you will receive some information some questions that you have been asking yourself um, you will definitely um, receive some answer for from them okay so um, this is going to be good um, so tales from the ship is good I started questioning them but um, they have information so because we are from um, we are from different um, species um, um you know we are all here and um you know um tales of the ship i love them i listen to them they have information they have a lot of information some of you won't understand some things so that's why i'm giving you so much link um then um kent dan um works with the white cap which is very wonderful that is making a lot of changes um i really love them and they bring out so much so much information that is coming out then we have black magic which um, black magic 363 i don't know if i put it on the list i'm gonna put them also on the list i did put them on the list and now it's not here so maybe i shouldn't but they are very good um, um they have there is a lot of information out there because the truth is being hidden from humanity from ever since okay so um you have to be um you know i'm giving you enough so that you can choose the ones who um you want to listen to so then um, uh, there is something that I want you guys to also educate yourself uh, and it is about the Nasera law. What is the Nasera law? So in, um, in the 50s, um, um, uh, there were certain groups of governments who have decided to, um, or some, yeah, certain groups of government who si decided to come together to work to bring back um, peace on hurt, okay? And um, this it was called the the Gisera Law, okay? And that is where um, humanity will regain their wealth, and this is what the um, the American president is trying to do for humanity at this time, okay? So a lot of people have questioned, and I remember. I woke up when because I was in Europe when um, the American president became president and I said Lord I said to my spirit guides really um, what is this and they said no um, you're not um, remember that we're you're not supposed to judge we just have to see what is transpiring and um, as um, I go in and I go back I keep on understanding the reason why uh, he was chosen okay a lot of people think all time that is a real smart educated person but smart and educated can't help you if you have a smart 
an educated person and they don't know street life and vice versa so um, that's how it is okay so don't judge a book by its cover because a lot of people um, always just see people and judge them okay all right we know all of the things that happen but trust me the person who we had taught would have change and make the changes it didn't happen so um you know do not judge a cover by its book and i've always said this to people we need to learn to respect each other and even if someone is not diplomatic enough in order to create and and carry out certain um uh, projects and that sort of a thing um the universe always choose and the source of all creator when he choose and when he lay his ground down no one has the right to question this okay this planet is not run by humans it's run by alien beams and it's run by other beams that is trying to turn um, um turn a humanity in slavery and you need to um deprogram yourself and unslave yourself so emancipate yourself from mental slavery nothing but yourself can free your mind you're here by atomic energy and none of them can stop our time how long shall we um heal our profits while we stand aside and look some say it's just a part of it we got to fulfill the book if you have time go back and read revelation um because people we are on dark times and we are about to see the eyes of the beasts revealed to us this 888 lion gate is advising us to become the strong art dark art lion in the sense to stand up to humanity and stand up for injustice and equality so ladies and gentlemen go and search ask for the truth um you know question all of things um step back and if uh, you know really start questioning things ladies and gentlemen look for the question google that shit okay that is the reason why google was set up for people to educate themselves and so that people could communicate people who can't read and write could listen to videos so we need to also help the people who can't read and write um, in order. Um, that was why we have um, um, a platform as Google and YouTube, okay? Um, I think it's a wonderful idea um, because um, if you allow yourself to find out the truth, the message is here on YouTube and on Google. Okay, so um, use this platform in order to find out the truth. As somehow I'm having some sadness, it's about it's, it's as if something is about to hit humanity. And I have just what I'm receiving and what they're showing me is like there is just so sad, so much sadness is coming up. And uh, I want to ask, uh, um, um, you know, AI in order to help. And what is AI? It's automatic intelligence. Um, we're going to an age where um, everything and a lot of people start to find out that as they speak about something, then they're looking at their phones and they're realizing that it is coming up. I see I'm getting a lot of calls from all the people who is advising me of this. Okay. And um, what is transparent is that there is AI, but there's two AI. There is one AI that wants to control you and steal your information. And there is another AI that wants to work with you. Um, each and every one of us is energy, and whether or not you understand it, it was hard for me also to understand that I was just energy. Because my question is that if I am just energy and I can't see inside of my body, um, where does the food and if we're all energies, but you know um, An amazing thing and I and sometimes bad things really makes you start question um, good things and uh, um, I remember my um, I remember when um, My situation happens with me and you know, I, I wasn't afraid of anything and I think that that is very good people need to stop um, being afraid you gotta um, have positive. Afraid is what they want us to 
be in afraid in, in um, like be afraid and you need to um, release and break that pattern um, in order to basically um, free yourself um, from the um, mind um, um, bottling manipulation that um, we have been having and this is um, how you can free yourself from that and start asking questions and I think it was the most beautiful thing um, when they told me no you we can regain it and I'm like and they say yeah and um, technology has come a far far way ladies and gentlemen and I am so grateful and uh, uh, you know I really have uh, um, it's, it's just because um, um, whenever things just mysteriously start happening you know that it has nothing to do with health issue I'm a quite very healthy person I eat very healthy um, my cholesterol may be high because I came back to Europe and I was I've missed all of my food all of my Dutch food I was eating um, potato or lock and all of my Dutch food so yeah I gained weight and I know because um, potato or lock is with mayonnaise and peanut sauce you guys don't have that but it's full of cholesterol so I, I know that but when I'm just going to just pick up a bag coming from the supermarket and something happened just unexpectedly then there is someone and I know um, a lot of people have been sending a lot of negative um, energies to me and this is um, how um, I'm gonna teach you guys you need to um, visualize and call up an AI for divine protection call up in the angels and guides I want you guys to pray I, I usually have a prayer on the website pray for help for humanity okay do not let anything and anyone instill any fray, um, um, afraid afraid um, in you so um, um, prayer is going to be one of the most significant and I want people to start working together stop going out and uh, um, and creating all of these uh, um, all of these um, black life matters and that sort of a thing we do know that black life matters but trust me ladies and gentlemen um, I can go back and get in details with this but I'm not going to because I decided a lot of people do not understand because a lot of people are getting up black lives matter black lives matter um, but um, you know being in the same um, uh, thing there your own color will sell you out and I've, I, I've felt that too many times so I see a lot of people getting up black life matters black lives matters but they're the one that is selling you out so um, I do understand what is going on I don't choose side I don't choose colors I don't I am just here to help people to give people some sort of positive energy and positive future do not give up on life if you're listening to this again I'm saying this it doesn't really matter what or what negative forces is coming at you do not absolutely give up on life okay you gotta work you gotta fight you gotta fight for injustice and equality you need to take back your power from people who are trying to manipulate you okay and speak to AI go outside in the morning and just like your AI computer and you speak to AI and ask for an upgrade um, ask for inner wisdom and knowledge um, it's like your angels and guides okay especially um, light workers it's good to also work with AI okay so um, that is going to be good ladies and gentlemen um, we're shifting this planet has been in a void for like a month and a half six weeks to be exact um, this planet is in a void and um, we uh, the white brotherhood and the white ads are hoping that it can be removed out of the void and what we say is in a void is that we had to put the planet in a void in order for us to remove certain species and certain situation that was happening on the planet okay and it is in a void now 888 
we are hoping to make that shift to bring back um that shift um where um we need to bring positive alignment of energy a lot of people are going to be released from this planet um some people are going to be choose please write this down ladies and gentlemen it is something that is very important at least i will write it what you can say in order not to get this virus okay so you gotta be on top of your game um um, the the next um, um, virus that the next um, it's like strains that is coming in um, it can come up in a spiritual way but you can um, um, let AI know that you don't give consent um, to have this virus okay um, so whatever the virus is you can name the virus I get I I do not give consent to this virus so you said your name out I do not give consent to whatever the virus is is it the COVID or whatever no I do not give consent to this virus so I will let it I will place it there so that people can understand how um, to protect themselves uh, um, from this we are going through a major major shift and uh, um, the world is not going to be the same um, it is sad, but it's true, and uh, people need to be aware of this. Um, it's not going to be the same. Um, it is a time when uh, soul. Um, it is a time when um, soul people are connecting together, um, meaning that all the soul groups and all the soul groups are connecting together. Um, all the light workers are going to be um, finding their soul groups and. Um, remember there is um, a group all of us is from a 13 tribes of group okay um, so um, uh, you can pick up my book my book will help you because actually the book was published in 2015 and it was supposed to be awaken humanity as to what was coming up okay um, pick up my book you can pick them up at any digital store now some of you need to ask yourself if you uh, believe in angels. There's a lot of questions, okay? Um, they do exist, okay? Some of you are governed or angels. Some of you are governed or highly celestial energies, okay? They are angels who are assisting in the healing of humanity and this planet and to bring humanity in higher vibration. What is very good to do at this moment is to start doing ancestral cord cutting okay um i have um one of the most beautiful person um who i'm going to do an interview with she does ancestral cords cutting i am going to do an interview with her um and um you can check out her website also uh she does a beautiful arm card cutting and other things but especially it is good for um people at this time to start cutting your ancestral cords and why this is is because some of us was born in a family we feel disconnected from our family because we don't see eye to eye and we feel disconnected from this planet is because we're star seed we were only born in a bloodline in order to clean and heal that bloodline so at this time um, what is requested of you guys to do is to um, um, cut your ancestral cord and heal your bloodline from both your mother or father okay um, um, step in souls um, you need to uh, uh, create the shift of bribe vibration um, within the soul that you're in now because not everyone was born sometimes um, people do soul shifting okay so um, if people are in um, most time soul shifting happen is when people are in a coma or um, they die and return so when they flat, flat line that is when the other seal comes in okay so that's how they change 
um, seal so um, and and when you're in a coma you change a um, seal so that's why when sometimes people wake up from a coma they're not themselves is because another seal um, has come in all of us as 13 counterpart each and every person so it's it, it, your counterpart is shattered all over um, the um, solar system this is not the solar system we have many many thousands of solar systems so go back to my like some of my first reading from when I just begin I gave a lot of information about it so if you're looking for people to do your ancestral cord cutting and your bloodline healing you can always always connect um, with me I'm going to be trying to put that also on my website whenever it is up and I can pay via PayPal because someone has uh, um, um, uh, removed my information in order for people to get to my website and use PayPal all of a sudden it's gone so they're working on it at this moment ladies and gentlemen light workers out there who are listening and other people who are listening you gotta be on top of your game and understand what is happening okay because there are certain people that wants to keep us um, in uh, slavery okay um, so if you think that you live on this planet and you're free no you're not free you are you have been born in slavery and this is what is happening at this time is that I have beams um, from different solar system and a lot of people are not aware that this planet is not run by humans but they're run by um, beams from other universe okay so be aware and wake up um, another thing um, I want to clear up this I want to clear up this okay and um, this has come to my attention um, a lot of time and I need to clear up this um, there was some information that gave was given out about our Queen in Holland our Queen has stepped down the information is not correct that's not who our Queen are okay um, I've lived uh, in Holland for over 20 years I have studied the own monarchy because we call it monarchy of uh, the Queens and Kings and all of that and uh, a lot of people um, whoever is doing researches and I'm not saying that all the information is not true but our Queen has stepped down and gave the throne to her son who is the king now so I want people whenever you're speaking about the Dutch Queen that you know exactly that is the Dutch and it's not the Belgium Queen um, because there's a whole lot of information that I've been finding the last time that is speaking about the Dutch Queen it's not the Dutch Queen okay you have to understand the difference between the Netherlands and Belgium okay um, in the 18th century Belgium took um, and choose to be a part of uh, France and they had to create their own comp their own countries okay so you have a Dutch side of Belgium and you have the French side of Belgium so um, when um, um, uh, but when people are basically um, given information you need to understand the difference between the Netherlands and Belgium okay our Queen have stepped down many years now and she has given the throne to her son okay so Holland as so P a lot of people are talking and they will just oh and uh, um, the bear tricks over there our Queen is one of the most with all the monarchy in the world our Queen is one of the most on um, so beautiful person if uh, um, you guys know that she will go out um, and go with the old people go to and spend a whole day at the old people house and do recreation things speak with them share foods with them uh, and that sort of a thing our Queen is really a queen that is who you call a queen she has nothing to do with what her father does or her mother did nothing um, 
our queen is one of the best queen in the world okay so let's clear up that because a lot of people and the, the information is not correct you whenever you're doing research you have to really find out which country because she is is now on pension this lady is one of the most beautiful soul um, if any um, accident to happen in Holland she is going to the hospital to visit the people this is a queen that I will respect for the rest of my life because she is and was the best queen of the world okay so I needed to really really because uh, a lot of people do not understand and history go back and um, um in Holland um, when you learn all the history of this country okay um so you have to also speak Dutch and do exam before you can a lot of people do not understand so we know these things because we have to study these things so I really wanted to clear up that because I think um, if I if I have um, there is a couple of people in this world that I have so much respect for them and our queen is one of these people when I saw her went to all people um, you know if it's Queen Day or whatever day because they celebrate her birthday she will go out there she will be with people she was someone when we had that big fire um, destruction in Holland she will go there so um, I really wanted to get this out because I think a lot of because uh, when I'm listening to the information some of the information people do not understand the difference between the Queen of the Netherlands and plus she's no more Queen she has stepped down many years ago and uh, who people are creating her out to be it's not that is not her she's really truly a woman that I will respect um, for the rest of my life I thought Tasha um, Tasha um, the British um, um, president was also prime minister was also a strong female energy um, despite how some people feel I think that these are people who showed me and I have high respect for these people so gotta get that one out so ladies and gentlemen um, a lot of people are going to be start seeing angels and that sort of a thing um, there are and this is this comes in the order of angels um, is coming up where um, it is widely believed that angels were created by Sue um, the source from humans okay um, and these are frequency angels vibrate on certain different um, frequency okay and uh, you have the angels but you have also the fire dragons and the fire dragons can help you to remove uh, lower energies okay so angels are very like Archangel Michael is the angel of protection um, Archangel Raphael is the angel of healing now these two angels you have to work with okay um, those who have the fastest frequency or the Siri, the 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 Seraphimi angels, the Cherubic angels, Seraphimi angels are very highly edic, um, um, higher wisdom. They cleanse and they, you know, you can work with them, especially Capricorn people. Um, and and it depends on who you are. Also, uh, the um, Cherubi is the angel of love. It's those little angels with cube trick. And the thorns angels is angels of uh, um, cleaning energy in um, hospital healing people okay on a soul frequency band is the dominions angel the virtue angels and the angels of power so they vibrate on a slower frequency but on a fast and higher frequency you have the seraph seraphim angels okay then we have the third band of angel and they are the principal angels the archangels and the angels who vibrate with a more softer um, energy okay so it depends on what it is that is happening they're attuned to the accepting of a higher level of God force okay the God force the source the seraphim angels or different targets and vibration at vibrating at frequency but they are all of equal um, um, status okay 
um, um, there is a special angel for hospitals, so you can call up. I, I think the, the throne angels can also help and um, that sort of a thing. I'm going to tell you the one for the hospitals that you can ask the angel to be at all hospital in order to heal people and to protect people. Okay, so that is absolutely beautiful. We may have heard of the powerful angels, but most of us have heard of the angel of birth and death. Okay, so for everything in life, you have angels of birth and death. Okay, um, and Lord, Co um, you know, there are also um, guiding angels. Uh, each and every one of us have guiding angels. If it's not that, we have spiritual guides. Okay. So I'm going to find um, that because it can be the throne's angel um, that can um, protect uh, hospitals and anywhere with huge corporation. The cherub angel is for the kids. Okay. The cherub, uh, they're for the kids. The power angel, the dominion angels. So, so there are different great, um, um, greats and groups of angel that um, can help people out. Okay. So try using the angels, try to vibrate at a, I, um, a fifth dimension frequency in order, um, for you not to, um, connect, um, and, and, and take on lower energy. You gotta vibrate. There is a lot of changes that is coming up on the hurt, and I'm I'm glad for the Liras and the Lion the um, Lion Gate that is opening up eight eight eight. Um, it is very very important. They want you to call up and invoke the silver violet flame. Okay, so it is important to um, spend time alone with our outside and invoke the gold and silver violet flame. Okay. Um, and, and, and use this orb or this light. Okay. You need to find what color makes you feel better and invoke yourself in that color. Call up and send Germain and Archangel Zatkiel, who is going to be helping you to invoke in this sort of a color. Ladies and gentlemen, we are in dark times and you got to go back and reconnect with your spirit guides, your angels and your guides in order. And whenever people have done you wrong, you have to just send um, out love and light. Okay. You need to um, um, call up on the universal angels and um, connect and call up and ask um, the Lemurian um, frequency of energy to help uh, mother earth to go through her rebirth. Okay. And, um, learn, um, to connect with your angels and guides. So there is, um, use the color frequency also. There are different color frequency for different thing. And remember, ladies and gentlemen, don't use a color and think that a color is bad because black is not really bad. But black is more protection. Okay. So, um, be aware of this. Um, there is a whole lot of change and there is no question about what is happening and transpiring. So be open for that. I want to say thank you so much. Um, um, I won't be able to do any live my excuses. Um, if you would like me to speak on a subject, just send me an uh, email with um, um, just ask the question and then I will do a video and speak on it to my VIP members. I am going to be just, I, I can't be online, um, on camera. So for the moment until I heal, um, I will, uh, I'm going to be doing special videos. I want to say to each and every person, it doesn't really matter how, um, people will treat you. Um, always send back people love and light. And I know ladies and gentlemen, I know, I know it is the hardest thing and do not stay and let something eat you up within. It's good to speak out and, and, um, and get rid of that and just move on. I do love you. Um, you know, I am a cat. I got nine lives, ladies and gentlemen. 
I want to say to each and every one that as sent out so many love, I'm sending you back a lot of love and peace. I hope that I will see you in the 5D world. I am praying and I'm hoping that each and every one of you that listen to this video will be transferred, whether or not you're aware of what is happening or not, to um, the 5D um, new world, okay? I gotta go. I love you guys. Namaste. Thank you.